might think that it'd be like I'd be most excited to be on a Broadway stage again, but I'm most excited to be in a Broadway audience again. You know, my favorite thing to do is to come to New York and um, run myself ragged, you know, run around all day, drink some espresso and see a Broadway show at night. It's the, you know, it's the, it's, it's what keeps me inspired. Um, so I'm excited to buy a ticket. I can't wait. I just can't wait to see. Um, there's something very special about a group of people in one room experiencing the same thing at the same time. And I think as a society we've been doing that for you know, hundreds of years. I think we'll do it for hundreds of more. So. Yeah, and no, what I'm looking forward to most is just, I, over the last year I just missed my community so much and doing what we do to connect with others. So having that back and, and finding ways to do that even better with more love and more care is what I'm about. And I'm excited for this year. So. Well, I mean, it's, it's an incredible sign of our resilience and strength that we can move through this time and reaffirm why we are creative and what we have to give. It's a part of our lives. It's our lifestyle. It's our identity. It's not just a, a, our occupation. It's a matter of a way of life. And to be without that for so long, it's, um, I'm, just, I'm just so grateful. I can't wait. Theater, please God. Coming and the, back. And the Winter Garden is such a beautiful theater. Yeah. So you're reminded of what a gorgeous, how gorgeous New York theaters are. You know, and so we need a theater. Oh, the world needs a theater.